Hey, welcome back to Staff Base. It's our new release today. Let's get a coffee and talk about it. Hey, Patrick. Welcome back to Dresden. I'm excited you're here today because that means we have a new release, 4.2. <laughs> Uh, and yeah, let's get talking about it. So it's been a couple months since our last one and I know that there's been all sorts of great stuff cooking in the product oh, yeah. department. And I would love to start with the feature that I'm most excited about, at mentions, they're finally here. Yeah. So yeah, what's new? Tell me about it. If you think about it, the people around you at work, they're really such an important part of every single day. Right? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. And just as in your personal life, you want to share pieces with them. Mm -hmm. You want to make them aware of conversations that they otherwise wouldn't have seen. And that's really what Admentions is all about. But I think you're the only Patrick. I know I'm the only Mackenzie in our <laughs> office, but there are quite a few Anyas. Yeah. So something that I love on social media is that if you start like adding someone, um, it'll give you a name suggestion. Does that work on our platform too? We make sure that you see the full name of the person mm -hmm. while, after typing an ad. You see the profile picture yeah. and you see additional information like okay. the role and the department so you're going to be really certain that you don't mention the wrong person okay good i'm, I'm relieved <laughs> <laughs> so um yeah i'm thrilled about out mentions i think a lot of people our users will really really love them too yeah. but i hear that in this release there's actually a lot of other great things that are going to improve employees lives so yeah. what else is new this release allows customers to bring in existing services into their staff base apps much more easily okay through our hub to connect HR services and there will be a lot of information about this on the developer portal but essentially what it does it provides a great looking front end mm -hmm. that is ready to use out of the box and therefore reduces integration effort a lot right um, this straightforward way to use HR services is available now for absence overviews and requests as well as shift plans so I know these HR services are going to be really useful, not just for employees, but also for admins and editors. And I hear generally that the 4.2 release has a lot of new great stuff that's going to let admins and editors make polished looking pages and news uh, even simpler than before. So tell me about it. What's new? Yep, there are actually a bunch of new things. Um, okay. First of all, the classic widgets are now available to all customers. Mm -hmm. uh, in self-service, right? So they can do it entirely on their own and that also includes sections. Oh, that's great to hear. Yeah. So that, that's really great. Um, additionally, for customers on dynamic pages, we're releasing an entirely new widget called the Portfolio. A whole new widget? That's, okay. that's super exciting. What it does, it in a very beautiful way, it shows those links with a nice big picture and a description below. And I think the, the last big part of 4.2 that editors are gonna be thrilled with and administrators is legal documentation. <laughs> but I've gotta admit that when I heard the phrase legal documentation, my socks were not blown off. I, I did not think this was like the most exciting thing in the world. Yeah. But since then I've realized that actually a lot of our largest, most global customers are already really benefiting from these improvements. So what can we do now that we couldn't do before? As you know, in the past, you used to have the possibility to have legal documents, mm -hmm. but only one set of legal documents for your different locations, branches, uh, full-time, part-time employees, right? And what's possible now is that you have multiple different legal documents. And as an employee, when you sign up into the app, you see specifically the documents that are meant for you. At the end of the day, this is really about large multinational companies getting the level of compliance that they need, mm -hmm. even in a modern channel like an employee app. And, and that's what we ensure here. Well, it sounds like there's been a lot of really great work that's gone into this 4.2 release. And I know our users are going to be really happy. Mm -hmm. So thank you so much for talking to me today. Absolutely. And of course, it wouldn't be a release video without a little bit of a surprise. Okay, but yeah. This time I don't have anything that catches on fire, no baked goods, nothing mm -hmm. that's exploding. Okay, sounds My compliant. My apologies, yes, sounds <laughs> compliant. <laughs> but I did realize that tomorrow is Valentine's Day, Patrick. So, True. will you tell me what do you love the most about 4.2? The, the experience for the end user, the, for the employees. That's uh, what we improve in, in all the functionalities that we're releasing. And um, I think that's really what it's about, yeah. All right, spoken like a true product professional. Thank you, Patrick. Uh, and I'm really looking forward to talking to you at our next release. So until then, and see you from Dresden. Bye-bye.